Hey guys, what's up? It's Josh. So for today's video, as you guys can see by the title, I wanted to talk about some different things that guys say, but like in the back of his mind, the things that he's actually meaning. When a guy is talking to a really pretty girl or a girl that he really likes or somebody that he's interested in, I feel like there's some things that he might say to you that in the back of his mind have a different meaning. And I feel like being able to open up and tell you guys these different things might be able to help you if you do like a guy and you're in that situation where you're kind of wondering if he's just saying something because he means it or if there's like a different message behind it. I feel like I get a lot of questions from you guys asking me just to talk about some different things that guys kind of keep as a secret from you girls. So for today's video, I thought that's what I would talk about and I hope you guys enjoy it and if you guys do get any information from this video or if you find it to be helpful, make sure to let me know in the comments and give this video a thumbs up. But with that being said, here is the first thing that I think guys say and what the meaning really is behind it. All right, so the first one that I want to talk to you guys about is when a guy tells you that he likes you. I feel like there are a couple of different meanings behind him actually saying that. I think that there's obviously a huge difference between I love you and I like you, but I think that when a guy tells you that he likes you, one of the things that he's also trying to get across is that he likes you, but he's not really sure if he wants to be fully committed to a relationship with you. Now, it sounds kind of weird to say, but I think that guys actually think this because when a guy tells you that he likes you, I feel like it just opens opens up more doors and it shows you that like he's wanting to go on more dates with you and he's wanting to hang out with you but at the same time like in those dates and in that hanging out with you maybe you guys aren't a right match or maybe you guys like aren't gonna end up together but it shows that like he's willing to want to go the next step but I think that sometimes we take the I like you as like they love you and they want to be with you forever and so it can kind of get confusing so I think that's the first one and one that might be kind of confusing but there's definitely that message that's behind it. So if he does tell you that he likes you, I think that you guys should like hang out more and definitely go on some more dates and figure out if you guys actually could be together and figure out if you guys actually could stay together. All right, so moving on to the second one, which if a guy tells you that he loves you, I feel like in the back of his mind, the one thing that he's thinking is, I have found the girl that I absolutely love and I wanna be with forever. And I think that guys don't openly kind of say that. Like, I feel like I love you is one of those things that is really special and you should treat it as like, you're actually telling somebody that you wanna be with them forever. So when a guy tells you that he loves you, I feel like if he is a genuine guy, he's honestly being able to tell you that he does love everything about you and he wants to be with you and he thinks that you're really special. And it's one of those things that I don't think you should take that lightly. So, so between like, I like you and I love you, I feel like there's definitely two huge different meanings behind them. So kind of pay attention to that. But if he does tell you that he loves you, I feel like that is a huge step in like a direction of being able to be with each other forever because he is kind of thinking that way. So this next one I feel like happens way too often, but it does happen all the time and guys do say this and I'll tell you guys what the actual meaning is, but when a guy tells you that like you're being over dramatic or you're overreacting about something, it's just that the guy doesn't want to admit that he's the crazy one, he wants it to be like put on you. In the back of a guy's mind when he does say you're overreacting, I don't think that it actually means that he thinks that you're freaking out and that you're crazy. Usually the case is that like guys just don't wanna fess up to whatever it is that they did or they said, or if they just did something and they don't wanna admit to it, that's definitely one of those things that guys are gonna say. So if he does tell you that you're overreacting, one of your first instincts is gonna be to freak out and tell him that he's crazy because it's probably something that he did, but in the end, you guys need to realize that guys actually know what we're thinking and what we're talking about. It's just that we're not really smart and being able to put it all together. <laughs> but yeah, that's another one and that's definitely the meaning behind when a guy actually says that. All right, so the next one is kind of interesting and if you've ever been on a date before or you're just walking around with a guy that you like, one of the things that might get brought up which is is I don't know, it just happens and sometimes it can be one of those instances where you don't really think about what's actually happening, but then it happens and then you think about it after and you're like, oh my God. <laughs> but next time you're on a date, let's say there's a guy that walks up to you and it's somebody that you know, but this guy that you're on the date with doesn't know that other guy. If you forget to introduce that guy to your date, which I feel like sometimes just happens, and your date asks you, how do you know that guy? I feel like in the back of a guy's mind, what he's actually thinking is, have you ever liked that guy? 
guy? Have you ever hooked up with that guy? Have you ever had a crush on that guy? <laughs> All those different things are what's going through a guy's mind when he sees another guy talking to you. There's definitely a different meaning behind that sentence. So I just think that a guy's conscience, sometimes he'll like think about stuff and then he'll try to put it into different words, but in the same time, you can kind of understand what he's saying because it's not that complex. <laughs> so yeah, that's another thing that a guy might say and what the actual meaning is. The last one that I want to tell you guys about is when a guy says, I don't think you should wear that out. Like if you tell a guy like, hey, should I wear this out? Like, does this look good? Sometimes for you girls, it can be a really good idea to get a second opinion from somebody. Now, the reason that I say that is not because the guy doesn't know what he's talking about or like the guy doesn't think that you look good or whatever. It's that the guy thinks that you might look so good that he doesn't want other guys to see you wearing that. Because guys get jealous so easily, like if we're hanging out with a girl or we like a girl and all of a sudden there's all these other guys hitting on you when we go somewhere. It's definitely not something that we want to happen and something that kind of sucks. So I feel like at the same time, like guys will do that because they don't want other guys to be looking at you or for other guys to find you so attractive because of what you're wearing. So if you do like a guy and you start asking him, hey, should I wear this? And you notice that like you're looking at yourself in the mirror and it looks really good, but for some reason he's not really into it. I think that there might be a different message behind there. And if you do ask one of your friends or like your parents or something if it does look good and they say yes and then all of a sudden you're like what the heck is going on <laughs> I feel like it's definitely because there's that reason behind there that he doesn't want other guys thinking that you look as good as you do which I feel like probably happens all the time to you girls so <laughs> so yeah that's another one that's something that guys will say and I feel like guys do it all the time it's just that you got to pick up on it and not think that you actually look bad in what you're wearing so that is the fifth one all right so those are five different things that guys will say and some different meanings behind what I think they're actually saying if you girls have had any guys say this to you before let me know in the comments which one or if you just can think of any other ones that maybe you think have a different meaning behind them I would love to hear about them below. Us guys, I feel like have so many things about us that when we actually explain them sound kind of weird, <laughs> but I like making these videos. So if you guys want to see more of them, let me know. Also, if you guys want to check out my vlog channel, I have that link down below. You guys can go and see it and watch more videos if you want to do that. So I'm going to be doing another giveaway soon on my YouTube channel. So if you want to be part of it, all you have to do is go and follow me on Instagram and you guys will get all the updates on what I'm giving away and like how you can actually be a part of it. So, so yeah, hope you guys enjoyed today's video. I love you guys so much. I hope you guys have an awesome rest of your day and I will see you next Saturday in next week's video. Bye.